Viewers and subscribers, you're welcome back again on this platform where we tell you undiluted truth. There came a video that people sent me, you know, our um, GGM ambassadors, they do send us videos of what is happening around them. But this one came in. It wasn't clear where it happened. But it is so heartbreaking that a government could be this wicked. <laughs> Good. Can you imagine? This is the kite of inhumanity. Man is meeting against another man. That's man inhumanity to man, as people may call it. Wickedness of the high places. Unfortunately, unfortunately, it is even the poor against the poor. Recruited tax force enforcers. Cows, the vagabonds, they mobilize to be carrying out either mobilize as a vigilante or tax force authorities and the rest of them. They go about harassing, intimidating innocent women. Even if these women maybe are going against the standard that is being set by government. Why don't you do it with human face? Look at that woman's head. It was brutalized with a gun. God! I don't want to say it happened in Anambra State or anywhere. And I want to advise anyone who is sending us any of these videos. Tell us the factual place where these things happen so that we can go there ourselves if need be. Tell us where it happened so that we can call the people involved out. Because if I had known the person or the area this thing happened, we will find out and fish out those people who are responsible in enforcing such kind of oppression in that place. And make sure that government does the needful. Charlie Wamba, if this thing happened in Anambra State, <laughs> hey, on a red. 
it is red. Let this kind of a thing never happen in Anambra State. And most likely, it is in Anambra State. I'm not saying it is in Anambra. I say most likely. Telling one battle is up to you. I just hope this doesn't happen in Anambra State. Because we've seen something like this happen in the past in Oka. We condemned it. We've taken our shots to redress it. Fine and good. But be mindful of people you are giving authorities to go and enforce any tax force. That is just the truth. Because <laughs> they are doing you no service. They are doing you big disservice. And it go red. Because now the people. Now then go. Now them go. Poor result. <laughs> you understand what I mean? So please, if you are sending us any of this video, it is very important you tell us the place when and how it happened in detail so that we can address it properly. Why I decided to make this video is for you, the people, to know the importance of speaking out so that we address some of this madness by government officials and put it to a stop because we can encourage our home to be better with this kind of attitude coming from government appointed tax force or authorities, whatever. I'm associated with Peters. GGN condemned this act completely. Completely, and we will go down to the root. In the fact, if you know where it happened, please, we need more information so that we can follow it up and make sure that these women get justice. Look at widows. Look at widows. Look at women. You do this to people's children, um, wives, or widows, or, or mothers. People who, little children are depending on their small hustle. You went there, carried everything, and destroyed and brutalized them on top of it. That is wickedness. The height of it, we can never take. This is the worst the government can do to our own people. And the GGM will condemn it completely. Please, if you have more information about this video, please come forward so that we get to the root of this madness and put it to a stop. I'm associated Peters, the advocate and the Archbishop General, leader of GGM Good Governance Ministry. Bye-bye for now.